ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पार्क टेक यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द डीपीडीटी रिले और सिंपली कॉल्ड एज द डबल पोल डबल थ्रो रिले विद इन द सर्किट विजर्ड सो फर्स्ट इन ऑर्डर टू सिमुलेट दिस रिले यू नीड टू गो टू फाइल एंड देन क्लिक ऑन यू हेयर यू हैव टू ऑप्शन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स प्रोजेक्ट एंड एलिमेंट्री सर्किट so you need to select the electronics project so click on okay now on the right hand side you need you can see this gallery option so click on this gallery option and we can see a lot of components and devices so what you need to do is to go for electromechanical and uh, not the electromechanical but electromagnetic and then relays so here you can see the dpdt relay okay now this is our relay it used to operate on 6 volt it can control two devices at one time because it has two contacts like uh, the two or co two common contacts so it has uh, like we can say a lot of current capacity as compared to single pole single throw or single pole double throw relay so let's take our power supply and switch so we will go for our power supply we can write this we will connect the coil ends of the relay with the battery and also one switch is needed to make on and off the relay so we have taken one push button switch and connected in series with the coil pin and the battery pin now we need two devices so we can take our motor as well as our lamp or if uh, we we can take even the led if we want okay so we can go for our led so we can take light emitting diodes so this is our diode and the other one is our motor so we can go for electromechanical component so where it is we have to search for electromechanical so this is our dc motor we need to combine the negative ends or one one ends okay the second end of these devices with the what's called as the negative terminal of the battery and positive end with the normally open pin of the relays which are not connected to the common normally so like this whenever we will give uh, energy to the or volts to the coil then what will happen this common connector will get attached to this one the normally open pin and in this case it is also you can see the cursor so from this position it will come to this one so do one thing that take one more supply for to control both these things so we can go for or one more thing that if we want we can common both of these uh, what's called as the outputs okay and we can connect them with the battery if we want okay so like this because we will change the battery voltage to 6 volts 6 volts okay so okay although it's a bit uh, dangerous for led to be operated on 6 volt but still we will see that either it is okay or not so we will press switch and it's on now so now we will press the switch now you can see that both the leds and motor are working properly why it is so because both the contacts of the double pole double throw relay becomes connected with the normally open
so hopefully you got the concept that how you can control the double pull double throw relay within the circuit wizard so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe